where people can really get together and share what they know, talk to each other, network. A lot of stuff happens here, but it's in cluster groups. So, Bree and I were in Brussels. He was working on the Drawbot. Here you see Divide. And we started talking about what we could do about that, and that's where Ignite came from. So, I hope you guys have a great time tonight. This is the first... Oh, and you'll see how these presentations go. <laughs> Bree is with Make, kind of the do-it-yourself arm of O'Reilly. They do a lot of open source gadgets. If you can't open it, you don't own it. Athos. I'm part of Radar, kind of the more tech-oriented part of O'Reilly. I'm the chair, co-chair for Emerging Telephony, Web 2.0 Expo, and the Where 2.0 Conference. If you have anything in those areas that you want to talk about, let me know. I'm all ears. I'd like to thank our sponsors, Antella and Amazon Web Services. They're going to be over there during the break. Uh, they're paying for some drink tickets. They're paying for the projector, the sound guy. And they're both recruiting, and they'll be over at that table during the breaks. I'd also like to thank the Seattleist and soon-to-be-wed Chris Perillo for also funding us. They pitched in for all this as well. Seattleist is a great local blog, and Chris Perillo is an amazing pundit in the tech space. So we just had... I just don't trust Keynote. Um, we just had our Ask Later, I mean our Popsicle Stick Bridge Building Contest. But I'm going to orient you first. You're, there's food to your right, and that's also where the sponsors are going to be. <laughs> Bathrooms are back there, as is the bar. To my right. To my right. <laughs> So we just had the popsicle sticks. <laughs> it took six people to break the bridge, which is great. And that was the make part. Now we're kind of on to the more techie geek part. And this is the ask later section. 20 slides, 15 seconds of slide, five minutes, kind of breathlessly done trying to race out to get your content shot out before your slide changes. These are some of our speakers. Don't worry if you can't read them. It doesn't matter. They're over before you can get a beer, especially with the way the line is. But we've got some great people. You've seen them at Mind Camp. You've seen them at other conferences. They're almost all local, except for one woman who flew in from Colorado. In parallel, we're also going to have Werewolf. Buster McLeod, right there, is going to start the game going, probably after the first round of talks. If you've never played before, Really quick, you're either on the villager side or on the werewolf side. And this is some strategy for you. Once you get your role, you can't trust anyone. And try not to kill the seer. The seer is a very important person who will tell you if they're a werewolf or not. So, I asked people to put in business cards when they first came in. And at the end of each talk, and be doing a drawing and giving out some O'Reilly books. These are the ones that I brought. And now, since this is my only talk and I spent most of it on admin, here are four quick things about technology that I wanted to talk about. The first one is OpenID. Has everyone here heard of OpenID? Okay, so OpenID is when you have an OpenID server account at a specific URL, and when you go to a site that's OpenID enabled, you just enter that username and then you have a password. So you don't have to create a new identity every time you go to a new site. It's a way for you to own your identity. Second thing is check this out. This is 3D immersive map video. This is from Immersive Media Company. When they film, they map 30 seconds per frame to basically an 11-sided camera like a soccer ball and film going forward. This is Mob Zombies. You get to run from virtual zombies in your local area. It doesn't know where you are, so the only route you have to escape might be through a wall. And then finally, parallels. Just working on that today to be able to run some of the Windows presentations, I'm just blown away by it. It is an amazing, amazing piece of software. As we hear from Jeff soon, virtualization is going to be huge. And then the final thing is Roots Camp. Think mine camp, food camp, bar camp, but it's for politics. I'd really like to throw one here in Seattle. Please come see me. We'll be doing it in January. I need some help. 
And finally, what do you do next? Well, tag your stuff Ignite Seattle, join the Flickr pool, let me know about feedback. Sorry, Brian, I didn't have your email address. And uh, check out the Ignite site if you're not really, if you kind of wandered in and don't really know what's going on. <laughs> and I think that's my last slide. And if not, <laughs> are there any questions for me? No questions. Great. Uh, All right. Welcome, Shelly Farnham.